ratchet straps are an effective way to secure cargo for travel because there's a variety of ratchet sizes and fittings, whether it's for hauling freight, recreational vehicles, or even furniture. However, if it's not used properly, the application will fail and could result in catastrophe. I'm Elle Roddinghouse. In this Zips 360 feature of the day, I'm going to teach you how to correctly thread and release a ratchet strap assembly. First, you can throw the long strap over the cargo and hook that end in place. Make sure the strap is flat and free of any twists or knots. When it comes to bringing the two parts together, you can crank the ratchet a couple times so the slot of the mandrel rotates to a better position. Now you can thread the end of the long strap between the ratchet and the bottom of the mandrel, then through the channel of that spindle. Now hook the end with the ratchet in place. Hold a slack. Having too much loose material will make it more difficult to undo later, but a good rule of thumb is to have three to four mandrel revolutions. Then you can start ratcheting. The mandrel will act like a spool and turn the strap as it tightens. Continue to crank the handle to create tension on the strap. Once you have the desired amount of tension and the cargo feels secure, pull up the lever inside the handle and close the ratchet to lock it in place. You don't want an excess of material moving around and possibly catching on something while you travel. So it's a very good idea to secure that extra strap material so it doesn't fly around and get caught or pulled on something. A simple way to do this would be to loop it around itself, creating an easy knot, but there are other methods as well. When you have arrived at your destination, pull the lever and open the ratchet handle as far as it will go. Keep your fingers away from the gears when you do this to avoid getting pinched. The tension will be released and you can pull out the strap to free the cargo. Wrap up the ratchet strap assembly so it's ready to go the next time you need it. Thank you for watching my ratchet strap demonstration. I hope the information was beneficial to you, or at the very least, a reminder of good practices to have. Find a variety of ratchet straps at zips.com.